words of Isaac Newton. If I have seen further, it is because I stand on the shoulders of giants. I wonder who those giants are. I came from the land of silk and cotton. Goods were not the only commodity traded on my land. You see, from a young age, I learned several languages and managed in translating ancient Greek and Indian texts, such as Pythagoras, and Euclid and many others. From the great Indian book on maths, the opening of the universe, I adopted the idea of zero as a number. This opened up a whole new world of mathematical possibilities and complexities. The terms algebra and algorithm, although familiar to most of us, how many have heard of their originator? <clears throat> That's why they call me the father of algebra. Let me introduce myself. My name is Abu Abdullah Muhammad Ibn Musa Al Khawarizmi. Most refer to me by just Al Khawarizmi, but I am known in the Latin world as algorithm. Do you ever wonder why X is commonly used in algebraic equations? It is because I, in my book, Kitab, Kitab al-Muqtasar fi Hisab al jabr al-Muqabla, the compendious book on calculation by completion and balancing called the unknown shade. The Greeks could not pronounce it, so they called it K. And the symbol for K in Latin is X. But what do I do? What is my pro profession? I am a mathematician, astronomer, astrologer, geographer, and a scholar in Beit al Hikmah the house of wisdom in al -Zaghdad. So there you have it. Just a thought. <laughs> Before I leave, next time, ask yourself why the neurons are called 